Welcome to Brooke's Cooking Show. Hey, welcome back to my channel. Um, I just wanted to say from now on, I'm going to be doing, I hope so, like fall themed and October themed foods. So today we are going to make a pumpkin cake. No, it's not going to have pumpkin spice in it. Um, it's just going to be a regular yellow cake, or I'm going to dye it orange. Um, an orange cake, but I'm going to put a pumpkin on it with icing on the top, hopefully. I'm not a very good drawler, so I don't know how this is going to turn out. But, um, yeah, so basically my plan is to make... The heck? That's all was ringing. Okay, so my plan is to make this... Oh, what? this yellow cake i'm gonna get some food dye i'm gonna dye it orange so it's kind of like a pumpkin and then i don't know if i want to like make the cake one pumpkin or if i want to put like a pumpkin out of icing on the cake i don't know if i want to like turn the cake into a pumpkin or if i just want to like pipe on some icing that looks like a pumpkin i don't know yet so um anyway i got this yellow cake i'm gonna dye the cake orange um i got some wait how much I got one cup of water, a third of a cup of butter that's softened, and three eggs, vegetable oil, this little cake thing, a bowl, a wooden spoon, lots of sprinkles, and um, got these little pumpkin sprinkles, these like fall sprinkles, and these Halloween ones. I also have this icing, which is like a decorating icing. Um, so I'm gonna use I'm gonna use that one, and I'm also gonna use this white one that I'm probably gonna also dye orange um to make it also a pumpkin um i don't know if i want to i don't know okay anyway so i'm going to make the cake really fa fast i'm going to put it into the oven i have to preheat my oven to 350 degrees and i'm going to tell i'm going to show what am i saying what am i saying i'm going to show you when the cake is done and then once it's done we will start decorating because this video is going to be basically me decorating a cake and not really making it, but I can show you if I make it. I can show you when I make it. I just dyed the yellow cake mix orange, and it's done mixing. I literally mixed that for like five minutes because I didn't soft my butter enough, so. Okay, so anyway, I'm just taking a pastry brush and I already sprayed this and so i'm just gonna make sure this does not stick or this will be a disaster so yeah i'm gonna tell you when it's done baking and then we'll get to the decorating so the cake um i just poured into here this is actually a lot more cake max than i thought it was gonna be it's like up to here which i'm kind of surprised about um i dyed it orange as i said before and i just tapped it on the counter for a little bit just so all the air bubbles were out i preheated my oven to 350 degrees and I'm going to, how long do I have to, and then I'm just going to uh, cook this for, um, it doesn't really tell me, it just says bake as, oh wait, actually it does tell me, I just didn't read the chart. <laughs> anyway, um, I'll tell you when it's done and I'll tell you how long I ended up cooking it for and then we're going to decorate it. I'm planning on to make it a two, -layer, two layered cake and I think I'm going to make the whole entire cake a pumpkin. So like I'm going to put the stem on top instead of like a pumpkin on the top. Anyway. I will see you guys when it is done. So basically, if you're wondering why this cake is very dark, it's because we had a little bit of trouble with this cake. So the top was golden brown and like the sides, but the middle wasn't. So that's why it's super like almost burnt. But um, we're just going to put some icing on it and see if it still tastes good. So I have this icing that's not totally done yet. Well, I'm going to do it. Oh, I got to show you guys. So that one was from, I, I made these like funfetti cakes, but I never posted that video because I don't know if I'll ever get it up, but maybe I will. Um, so this is just going to be the crumb coat, and then I'm going to do this whipped vanilla. I'm going to dye it orange, and then we're going to make that the actual pumpkin. Um, but I also want to cut this open and make it a two-layered cake, and then I'm also going to use this to make this. Well, I'm going to make that the little, like, decorations on the bottom and all that. So and then we're going to put some sprinkles on it. So um, I'm going to cut this into a two. You could probably use two pans, which I probably should have done. Um, and it's very flat, actually. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to cut it in half, and then, yeah, instead of using two pans, I'm just going to cut it in half, and then I'm going to ice it, so, yeah. It's not going to even cut, but it'll be fine. You can see, like, it's very uneven, but, so I let this icing defrost because I kept it in the refrigerator, and since it's all nice and defrosted, I'm going to make this either the crumb coat, and then I'm going to dye a little bit more on orange colors so I can make that the... 
Um, for those of you who don't know what a crumb coat is, it's so you can get all the crumbs covered first, and then you can. So since I cut this like very very uneven, don't know how well this is gonna ice, and also the cake is just like very flimsy. I think it's because it's like one of those like moist cakes, and so it's not really gonna become that good. So, um, yeah, I don't know how well this is gonna work out, but I'm gonna try my best. Um, anyway, I'll get back to you when I kind of get a good crumb coat. Okay, so I dyed some of this whipped vanilla icing, and I put some in the middle, because I cut the cake in half, and then put some in the middle. This cake already looks really ugly, but um, hopefully when we put the icing on, it'll look kind of like a pumpkin. Um, so, yeah. Okay, ready? There we go. Guys, this is going to be the worst cake ever. <laughs> it's a very small pumpkin. <laughs> Just hopefully when we're done, it looks a little better. Alright guys, I'll tell you when I'm done, actually. Okay, so we got it iced with some orange icing. And then, now I'm going to take um, this one, and I'm going to do it around the sides, and um, maybe like some like lines. And I'm also going to try to dye this green. I dyed it. I didn't save any on mistake. So hopefully I can get that to be green. And we're going to do the stem. So i um, I'm gonna try to see if I can do that, and I will see when I'm done. Okay, guys, here's how the little cake turned out. Um, that's kind of a dark purple. I don't really have black, so that's the closest I could get. And there is my jack-o'-lantern cake. Um, so now I'm probably gonna go car- I'm sorry I didn't, like, film that much in this video. But I put some little pumpkin sprinkles on the sides. Some pumpkin, um, candy corn. And, um, yeah, that's- basically it and now i'm gonna go carve a pumpkin once again sorry i didn't film that much in this video um anyway yeah maybe i'll show you uh, my pumpkin at the end of this video thanks for watching brooks cooking show sorry i look like a mess right now but i just realized i did not film an um outro so i just wanted to say make sure you subscribe to my channel if you like my channel hit the like button if you like this video and um hit the notification button so you never miss one of the videos that I post. I think I got the subscribe. I think I got everything in there, okay? So, um, I also, I recommend you guys to make a Halloween cake this year. Uh, I think you guys can really do it, and I believe in you guys, so I think you guys can do it. Um, also, I just wanted to show you guys my pumpkin, um, that I carved yesterday. Yes, it was yesterday. Um, the reason why it has just one tooth and it has a really humongous now mouth was because one of its teeth fell off. You can see, like, right there. And so, then I just had to make the mouth even bigger, and then I just had to add it one thing in there. So, yes, I carved this all by myself, and I had to actually um, take the guts out on my sister's pumpkin, because she will not take the guts out on hers. And I'm planning on to make some, maybe, like, um, pumpkin seeds or something with them. I actually never had them before, so. Anyway, tell me in the comments down below, do you guys like pumpkin seeds, or have you ever made them before? Um, tell me in the comments down below. Anyway, guys, I love you so much. Please stay safe and um, have a good happy Halloween.